Hi everybody, we're going to do a Q&A today. We're going to cover jacket lengths. Uh, we just did a video on trouser fit last week and actually brought up a lot of questions about jacket length, so I thought this is a good time to tackle this topic because it's actually a little bit more of a complex topic than one might expect. And uh, let's get started. So right now I'm wearing the Armory's Model 3 jacket as part of a suit. It's a size 48, it's 75 centimeters long, and I'm 175 centimeters tall. Our rules for jacket lengths are you should be seeing roughly half jacket and half trouser. So visually, like what you see up here should be equivalent to visually what you see here, okay? Um, also, the jacket should always cover the butt. So my butt is somewhere there and I probably got another two centimeters or so underneath that. And uh, one rule that a lot of people bring up, but I would always tell people to avoid is some people say, oh, you know, you should follow where the knuckle of your thumb is. That's great if you have very average length arms, but if you are, for instance, like me with quite long arms, um, my knuckle is quite far down my body. The jacket would be incredibly, incredibly long if I was to follow that rule. So that's why I always say just half jacket, half pants. All right, now let's have a look at what happens if you start varying the jacket lengths. And let's also look at what happens when you are going from a suit jacket to a sport jacket, okay? So let's start with... This is another Model 3, size 48, so same length. Now, what I find when you change from a suit jacket to sport jacket is since the fabric up top is noticeably different from the fabric below, it makes the jacket seem a little bit longer, a little bit bigger than it really is. Like there's a bit more presence to it when compared with a suit jacket. So, yes, I like this fit. I'd totally be happy with taking a jacket in this length, but actually I wouldn't mind a, a slightly shorter sport jacket. And that's often what we find with our bespoke tailors is that the sport jackets will be ever so slightly shorter than our suit jackets. Now let's look at a size 46. So this is that same suit fabric, but this time in a size 46. This is 73 and a half centimeters long, slightly shorter. I like this length and this proportion as well. And while I like it for a suit, I actually like it better for a sport jacket. Let's have a gander at that. See how like, because this is a sport jacket, it has a little bit more presence on the body and it seems almost a little bit longer. Okay, now let's start going into an extreme. Let's look at what happens if you go all the way down to 44. So a 44 is another centimeter and a bit shorter. It's about 72 centimeters. This is a 44 jacket. It's gonna be too tight for me in the body and the shoulders. Um, but this is really just to illustrate length for you. So see now this doesn't even cover my butt. My butt's like over here. And it just looks proportionally not very flattering. Like the jacket is kind of stout and stubby and my legs end up looking weirdly long. Especially as a suit, the jacket seems to be extremely small for lack of a better term. But what's interesting is that when we look at a 44 sport jacket, I actually am more accepting of it. I don't love it, but I feel like you could get away with it. And this goes to, sh this is an illustration of like why um, I say sport jackets seem like they're a little bit longer because they're contrasting fabrics. Like if you look at that, that actually seems a little bit longer than the 44, despite, than the 44 suit jacket, despite the fact that the measurements are actually the same. So like I could sort of live with this, I don't think I could live with that. All right, uh, let's also look at some bespoke pieces. Um, so for instance, Liverano does the shortest jacket of all the bespoke tailors that we work with. And this is a Liverano jacket in 74 centimeters. 
But I really like this proportion, especially as a sport jacket, right? Like I think that, you know, when you're thinking about jacket lengths, as you tend towards being a little bit longer, it makes it a little bit more elegant and a little bit more formal. Whereas as you tend towards short, it makes it a little bit more sporty and a little bit more casual. Um, so obviously with a sport jacket, it is nice to have it a little bit shorter. So this like is the absolute limit for me. Like it is just barely covering my butt and it is, uh, but I think visually like the proportions work. Like it's still just long enough for it not to look stout or stubby. And it's giving me a lot of leg line, which is really important. Like, you know, you want the leg line to give people the impression that you are tall, that you have kind of a slimmer frame. It's a more flattering silhouette. All right, last thing I'm gonna touch on, um, and this is to do with front and back of jacket. I can dig up my original jacket here somewhere. There you go. So different tailors, different brands have different philosophies on this. Like, should a jacket be longer in the front, longer in the back, or level? Now, the real answer is there's no standard. It's kind of an aesthetic choice from tailor to tailor, company to company. Um, you know, a lot of our tailors do tend to prefer long fronts with the exception of, I believe, Dembeck um, actually prefers it level. Um, our ready to wear tends to be longer in the front just by a little bit. And this is something you do see a lot in ready to wear. Uh, it's not wrong, it's kind of, a, it's an aesthetic feature, but it's also a provision for people who have a little bit of a paunch, right? So if you have a little bit of a paunch, let me simulate that. Simulate that more than normal since I do have a little bit of a paunch. Like by having the jacket a little bit longer in the front, if you just pull it forward, like rather than making it look like the jacket's kicking up, it actually just allows you to cover that paunch a little bit better while keeping the bottom of the jacket level. Okay, so there we go. Our little deep dive into jackets, just to summarize one last time. Lengthwise, half and half, always cover the butt. That's all it comes down to. All right, thanks for watching.